Hey guys, Scary Stories here. Instead of doing the regular terrifying stories that we usually do, I thought it might be fun to look at some videos and photos instead. Bear with me, as this is the first time I've kind of figured out how to do this. And uh, I'm hoping the audio sounds decent. I'm trying OBS for the first time. But yeah, I thought it might be fun to do something a little casual. You know, can kind of just let loose and we can have some fun together. I got my ice block out for my computer, so the fan shouldn't be too loud. But if you eventually hear it, I apologize. And I have a Red Bull going. Oh, there you go. So uh, without further ado, let's look at some ghosts. Okay, guys, dog and face in my grandparents' house. I was alone in the house while everyone was outside. They've never had a dog. No one looks like this face in reflection. Let's look at the first photo first. There's two photos. Let me see a big X here. I don't know if that's going to be the face. That kind of looks like a hand. That kind of looks like a scream mask or something. But I'm not seeing anything too... And there's a dog. But she said there wasn't a dog there, so I don't know. Okay, let's... Let's look at the second photo. <laughs> oh my gosh. It would be helpful if you had more photos. We can see comfy chairs in the background that are a similar color to your dog. So a picture looking down might show a similar looking chair. There's a guy in the reflection sitting on the couch wearing a shirt with American flag on it. Oh my. Oh, you're talking about that's the person taking the photo. Unless, I don't know. That's fine. Moving on. Ghost on vacation in... Corfu, Greece? Any idea if I caught something paranormal? Three photos this time. There's a car, a moon, or a star, planet, I don't know. Not an astronaut. Do you guys see the ghost? Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, okay, wait a minute. <laughs> Sorry, I was... Making fun of it, I wasn't zoomed in all the way. That just looks like a person, though. Right? Oops, that's the last one. Yeah, dude, that looks like a person just looking out at the water. It's a beautiful night. Right by the sign. Right there. Yeah, that's just a dude. Ghost is wearing a mask. Oh, well, I'll edit that out. <laughs> At first I didn't think much, but the more I look at it, the creepier it gets. You're... you're silly. Okay, we need something really scary. So I always like to go... This is the first video. This is the first time we're doing this, so... We can definitely... hit up some classics. You may have seen some of these, but... We're just going to the top of all time on our ghost. You've definitely seen the, the wheelchair in the hospital. This was about a year ago. I do security at a hospital. The chair was on the other side of the hallway on my first patrol. And on the second patrol, this is what I had found. This is really the only time I've ever experienced anything spooky like this. Never really was a believer until this happened. It's just the, uh... The wheelchair moves as you saw while I was reading that and the uh, security guys like nope I'm out or something like that oh can you hear that oh, he swears I'm sorry see see I fucking don't know no, no, oh my no, no. gosh so I don't know if I set up OBS right you might not have heard that but my cat used to do this in the downstairs bathroom 
She passed in November. I live alone. And we have toilet paper dragged from the bathroom all the way to the hallway. What do you think about that? Ghost? Or did the person posting the photo just do this? Don't know. Uh, oh my gosh. What? It's gonna glitch out. I'm telling you, I've seen. Oh my god. Yeah. A picture one of my friends took a few years ago during a get together. A person that looks like a soldier holding a musket can be seen in the background. He definitely can. There's the, the barrel. There's his head. He's just standing there. Maybe it's your neighbor coming over to tell them to quiet down. Yeah. Could just be a tree. It looks like that's a tree there, so... I'm not saying there's a uh, tree-shaped man, but you know, the artifacting and stuff in the photo. Yeah. Debunked. Let's see. Oh man, this scared me so bad. Like slams. Oh. Yeah, I don't like that. Yeah. Let's mute that. Strange door banging during police operation in Brazil. We've all seen this one. This one's trippy. Saw it on the police officer's Twitter. Oh, I hope that's not too loud. Saw it on the police officer's Twitter page today. Very strange. Seems like an abandoned hospital. Smashing glass. This is from two years ago. I think somebody explained it since then. I don't know if it's like a hoax or not, but that one freak. Oh, this one really freaks me out. Look at the girl. Yeah, I don't like that. This video was filmed by a friend a few years back. In the left corner of the video, you can see a figure dressed in white with black hair crawling out from under the trampoline. To this day, we have no idea who the person was. Right? That's... That's scary. I don't like that. You can see it clearly. I don't think it's a ghost girl or anything. But... I think it's probably just somebody that was chilling, like someone that's... You hear those stories about footsteps upstairs in your attic. And then, and then you keep going to check out what's making the noise and there's nothing up there. And then one day you go and you look behind the painting you have that's kind of leaning up against the wall. But not hanging up. It's just kind of being stored there. And then there's this emaciated, emaciated, whatever, scary looking woman that's just out of it. And she's living in your attic. That's what that reminds me of. Like just somebody that's a little off the rocker. Probably the best picture I took in my life. Uh huh. Because of Mickey Mouse? No. It's the window. Oh. Yeah, that's creepy. We got like a pig face. Gross. Yeah, that's a good one picture my friend sent me a few years back after moving into her new apartment in Charleston, SC, South Carolina. She was taking a pic of her dog. Is it the other dog? That's what's weird or... That is kind of weird looking, but it's just like a dog moving. It's gotta be something else. Garbage bag. Beer bottle. This person's place is really messy. Ah, I shouldn't say that. This mean. Is that? Oh, maybe it's that. That could just be like a coat on a rack, though. The dog is cautiously approaching and is fully aware of what it is cautious of. The dog's head is all hunched low, like it's hyper focused and ready for a quick response of necessary. I understand what you're saying, 
The dog is walking forward, but seems in my opinion, the dog's looking at a figure while probably investigating. Definitely. The food bowls. <laughs> the food bowls are straight in front of the dog, though. The ears and tail tell all. No, they don't. They don't tell all. Especially when it's so blurry. It tells all. No, he's just walking over there. And even if he's not, there's like... Dogs freak out at like little bugs all the time. It's a person. Why do you people read into something so simple? It looks like a hooded coat hanging up. That is exactly what I said. Edit. It does look like an actual person though. To be fair, I have no idea why they think it's a ghost. Yeah, I mean it looks... It looks like a person, but that's what a coat looks like because you wear it. Right? Anyways, I'm looking too into this. Let's move on. Okay, let's do, uh... Let's just do a few more. Ghost sighting at the Pirate House in Savannah, Georgia. More info and comments. Look at that guy. Interesting. Did you take any other photos of the area slash doorway to rule out mirrors, reflections, etc.? I did not, but that would have been a good idea. The paint in the hallways didn't seem too reflective, plus my family was standing with me, so I would imagine it would have looked like multiple people. What did your family think of the picture? Have you had any weird experiences since you've been home? I hope it didn't follow you guys. LOL. Okay. Well. That's creepy. Strange woman caught on my game camera in the yard. I live out in the woods at the top of the hill. At the top of a hill. I should mention that the ashes of the lady who lived here before were spread on the property. Well, that's not a good sign. That definitely looks like her. Right? The head. The dress. Oh, look at that. You can see their, their iPhone. Looks like they got an otter box on or something. A little camera. Why didn't they just upload this photo itself? They took a picture of the picture. Probably because they edited it. Is there any way to upload the pictures and post the direct images instead of a picture of your screen? Agreed, a screenshot or original picture would be better. I wish I could, but this is all I have left of the image. It's from last year, and I often delete things from the SD card to make room. Unfortunately, I'm only able to view the SD card on my boyfriend's older MacBook, and I didn't save it on there. I just took these photos. I tried to debunk the photo many times, thinking maybe it could be me, but I don't go walking down my driveway without a flashlight, and it almost looks like she's wearing a dress, which I wouldn't be wearing. Where I live, I believe Native Americans once were... what? Where I live, I believe Native Americans once were because I found Flint, and also I know the woman who passed lived here for a long time and had her ashes spread on the property. The property is at the top of the hill, on about five acres, and backs up to nothing but woods. Why do ghosts wear clothes? They are not part of you. How do they become translucent like ghosts? It's gonna be weird when ghost sightings stop being, she's wearing a long dress to being, <laughs> she's wearing a shirt with Taylor Swift on it, or he was wearing a Dwight Schrute t-shirt. I'm sure there already has to be a few ghosts with wacky t-shirts or something floating around. Oh my. Okay, well, I think we'll leave it there for the first video. Hopefully you enjoyed. I thought it might be fun to do something just a little bit more casual. Something where I can just kind of talk with you guys and we'll see what you guys think. If you hate it, let me know too. That's super important, so I'm not doing stuff that you guys don't like. With that said, if you... If you did enjoy, feel free to like the video. Feel free to dislike if you didn't. Say hi in the comments down below, or, you know, let me know what you think. And I'll see you on the next one. I hope you have a good night. Bye for now.